Yo, what's up? Sneaky kid. I just hit my headphones. Yo, what's up? Sneaky kid, and here. Today, I should be playing Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Origins. Now, if you don't know, this is a free, open source fan game of Pokemon Mystery Dungeon. So anyway, let's just play. So yeah, I have a mod installed, which is just. It's just like an extra all starters. Yeah, sure. So there's a bunch of mods that are pre like included with this. So I can just choose every single Pokemon now. You might think I'm gonna go with Pikachu, but no, for the sake of this, I'm actually gonna go with Snivy. Yeah, you can choose as a non-binary character as well. I'll choose as a girl. Because I'm so original. So yeah, Pokemon Mystery Dungeon on PC without emulation. Someone actually decided to make this. Yes, I'll go to the Guildmaster's trial. Or trail. Did it say trail or trial? It says trail. I still love Mystery Dungeon. I'm honestly, I'm honestly angry that they've never actually made, that they haven't made another proper Mystery Dungeon game. They've made a remake, but they haven't made another proper non-remake Mystery Dungeon since uh, the 3DS era. Oh, I fucking love the Mystery Dungeon, like, series of games. Not just Pokemon in general, I just love the layout of Mystery Dungeon. And if you've never played a Mystery Dungeon game, never mind just a Pokemon Mystery Dungeon game, if you've never played a Mystery Dungeon game at all, I highly recommend them. They're really fucking good. And also quite replayable since it's, well, it's, it's a roguelike. I don't know how to explain it to someone who's never actually heard of the term roguelike. Oh, okay then. A rare fossil. I picked, wait, I picked up three rare fossils. That was a bunch of rare TM raw. I got another TM. Ah yes, that did so much. It'd be cool if you could like use the right analog stick to like aim yourself. Okay, you literally can't even. You literally can't even. I don't know how to. I don't know how to speak. You can't. Um... Thingy. You can't speak. Oh, whatever, I forgot what I was going to say. <laughs> oh, really? Really? Yeah. Oh, you mother motherfucker. You motherfucker. Oh yeah, that is so fucking much. It's a Houndour. Also, yeah, this is really bad. Uh oh, I'm dead. I'm so unbelievably dead. <laughs> Red Fossil. A weapon to be thrown. It flies high in an arc to clear obstacles and strike. Target area deals special damage. Uh... Ah, the grass. The... I think the grass is a new mechanic in this particular game because I don't think I ever saw a game like a Pokemon Mystery Dungeon game with grass that obscures my vision. Ah, uh, how much fucking longer? This is like the tutorial. How much longer? A Pichu, huh? Ah, yes, very effective. Fucking hell! Oh no, a shop. It's Shuckle's shop. You replace the Kecleon with. Huh? How much money do I have though? Uh, I have 440. Money! Money! Revive a seed. Well, I know I can sell items. Let me talk to you. Oh, but I can... Oh wait, is that all of them together? <laughs> wait, what? Why did... What? You're helping me? Why are you help? What? Special attack fell slightly. What is happening? Okay, so 500. So if I'm missing, so if I'm not mistaken, you could, yeah, 500. I'll place this as well. 500? Yes, please. Because I'm a good, I'm a good patron. I don't steal anything. Think about it. The shopkeepers are usually given a, a high boost, but it's like, should, should I try? No, I'm not going to try it. I need it. I need it. Oh, a cynical as well. Oh, that does nothing. And I'm dead. What a fool. One does not simply walk through the Guildmaster trail. One does not simply walk in Mordor. Woohoo! Don't get ahead of yourself, young one. The dungeon has long been known as the most dangerous of this entire island. You are an explorer, correct? Tell me, what is the name of your team? Um. I don't fucking know. So your group is known as the Pika Kids, yes. Whoo! 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 I certainly hope you know what you're getting into. Many teams are attempting the Guildmaster Trail, yet not a single one has met the success. Might I suggest an alternative? Head east and you'll find a camp of friendly Pokemon. You can stock up on supplies there. 
If you're looking to explore this island, I suggest you start with the tropical with the with the tropical path. And if you seek knowledge of mystery dungeon, come and speak with me. Wait, it says like uh, little what? Oh, okay then. Ah, drenched bluff. Oh, a reviver seed. Just just a casual reviver seed. I don't remember if the 2D mystery dungeon games ever went up to Gen 5. Yeah. Oh, some kind of picked up another fucking reviver seed, Jesus. Well, I found the one with the Reviver Seed instantly. Oh, hey, Sandshrew. A friendly Sandshrew. The Pokemon here are really weak. Well, I can take them out with my re I can take them out with my regular attack, but if I never use my moves, I won't gain experience points for winning. Was that always how it was? This is very much the tutorial, even though the tutorial was apparently the hardest level. You can't throw a wild Pokemon when you're in these Mystery Dungeons, but me, I'm harmless. You can tell from the colour of my map icon, and the yellow outline around my shadow. Yes, I know, I've played Mystery Dungeon before. Also, yeah, the Apricorns are new, because I don't think Mystery Dungeon ever had Apricorns. In fact, I know for a fact they never had Apricorns. Hook Village. Well, that's one letter, that's one letter away from f Friendly. Just start there. And store all my money, just in case I lose them. When Trailblazers first came to climb the mountain, they set up rest camps along the way. But after they passed the ravine, the areas became too hostile to camp in. Even now, there's no clear path to the summit. Snorlax is in a deep sleep, obnoxiously blocking the entrance. <laughs> so, Fader Trail or Bramble Woods? Yeah, sure, let's go Fader Trail. Wait, does this game actually have some original music? Because I don't think I, don't think I recognise this song. It fits well though. So I can't tell if it's actually original or not. Oh, oh, I get it. Preview the the distance of it. I get it. Well, I'm almost dead, so I need I need some health. Badly. Another reviver seed. Fucking hell. Aren't reviver seeds meant to be like rare? I've got like three of them. A luminous orb. Now, if I'm not mistaken, orbs in the games have always been just blue, but it seems like they've actually coloured them differently now, which is actually good. So much effort put, so much effort was put into this, like Jesus Christ. Fans are just absolutely insane in what they can do with these kinds of things. It's like, hey, if Chunsoft or anyone at, uh, or anyone working with or at Nintendo isn't going to make their own mystery in this game, we the fans will make our own. Is this another revival scene? Another- Okay, seriously, is the game just spawning reviver scenes just because it's like the tutorial? No. And then Vine Whip. No, missed again. Vine Whip. Come on! Fucking Vine Whip. Fentolin growth. Growth sucks. No, thank you. I can find any Epicorns. That distinct aroma can pacify hostile Pokemon. Toss one at them and it might make a friend. Oh! So they changed how the friend thing works. So instead of just defeating the Pokemon, you have to throw out Apricorns at them. To be honest, I never liked that mechanic in, in Mystery Dungeon, so that's an interesting change. Switch tail. A switch that opens blocked various blocked passageways around the floor. Oh. Well, that's new. That's a leper berry. Let's try it. Uh... Okay, that's cool. Okay, let's try it on you. Throw! Ah, so if it fails, you don't actually lose it if it fails, it just drops to the ground. Okay, then. Oh. Secret stairs. Oh, so this is just an e So this is just an area with a bunch of, uh, like, items. I'm assuming it- I'm assuming it works better if it's, like, the same, like, colour or whatever, like, ah, it says it right there. That makes a lot more sense. Be my friend! My best friend! Yes, friends, kill! Oh, Snubble. Uh, I believe Snubble is now normal fairy, right? Oh, and I've wasted my white one. Gah! Oh, the hidden trail still goes. Apom found a warp one somewhere. Oh yeah, because pickup. Because Apom probably has the pick. Yep, Apom has the pickup ability. No, don't attack my friend. Stop attacking my friend. Ow. Get him. 
Get him! So how many flaws does the hidden trail have? Well, I have no PP for any good moves. The only damaging move I have left is rap. Which just... <laughs> Let's just say rap is crap. Well... Let's just go. No, I didn't mean to do that. Ah, there we go. Beyond the dungeon lies a new area. You can now go to Fault Line Ridge. Did so... Oh, there they are. <laughs> Let's go, it's really time to go. Let's just store all my items. I pretty much do this all the time. I mean, I do I do sometimes take items, but yeah. So yeah, this is a really good interpretation of Pokemon Mystery Dungeon. I mean, Pokemon Mystery Dungeon is really fucking good, and I do genuinely recommend playing any of the Mystery Dungeon games. So anyway, I've been your host, Pika Kinnady, it's been Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Origins, and you've all been fantastic. So until the next video, I say bye-bye.